what they're. Right. If they How's anybody going to know that? But just, how is anybody going to know that? Well, I, I know it. So that's uh, these people who are organizing it. Uh, uh, obviously, uh, they should be contacting the city to. Uh, the city manager wishes to respond. Through you, Mr. Chairman, I I, I would uh, I'd like us to. Uh, respectfully exercise uh, some measure of caution about our involvement uh, with this process. I would be uh, pleased, as I said, to uh, take all of uh, council discussion as, uh, as, as your interest in having me develop a plan. Uh, City Hall will, of course, and the premises are closed on Sunday, so uh, the risk to internal uh, Goings on will be reduced, of course. Uh, I will work with uh, all of the uh, appropriate uh, departments in the city to talk about some of the issues that you've raised about security, occupancy permits, and those kinds of things. And we'll uh, also ensure that uh, members of provincial parliament and affected ministers and so on are aware of this. Uh, but essentially, uh, the public does have a right to assemble and to express their displeasure. And uh, as long as they do so in an orderly way that is in keeping with community safety, uh, then I think our responsibility then has ended. Okay. Councilor yeah, Moore. Yeah, Mr. Chairman, that's fine. I, I, I'm hoping that uh, if they are planning to come here, that they should be getting in touch with uh, the city uh, staff and say, look, when I come on Sunday at the night, and, uh, uh, this is what we want to do, and or, we organize it. We, it's not right that they just show up here in the night, and then who knows uh, what what to expect. So there should be some kind of a process in place. If uh, you want to have a demonstration at City Hall, then you should be then you, somehow you should be, be informing the city somehow. Through you, if I may, I'm sure there is a protocol. I, I just am not familiar with all of that, but we'll do that as part of my due diligence. Councilor Moore. Thank you. A lot of it's been said. The good news is we have two days to make sure that we cross all our T's and dot all of our I's <coughs> and um, do what we need to do to plan for what we know is coming. And, uh, the, you know, quite frankly, people come downtown they, for a whole variety of reasons. They come down to protest the war in Afghanistan if they want to, or they can come down as they did last summer almost every weekend to celebrate the Soccer World Cup. It just is, you know, a magnet for those who wish to assemble and, and celebrate or send a message. So I think it's, it's the kind of activity that, you know, whether it is our jurisdiction or not, I mean, we raise flags in the square for um, causes and initiatives and agencies in our community that is not our area of responsibility, but we support them and through that demonstration, so um, you know, thank you for the heads up. It's a good news report. We've got two days' notice to plan. Thank you. Councillor Dillon. Uh, thank you, Mr. Uh, my concern was only like uh, when they build a new hospital, and there was a news that city is not paying enough money to the hospital. People don't know that the hospital is not under the city. The provincial government always pays the money to the hospital. And when the protest is going to happen here in City Hall, and people still are going to think uh, that the city didn't provide money to the hospital, and we should send a message to the community as a member of council that this is not under the city. The provincial government take care of this. I have no further speakers. Uh, I, I think uh, uh, my, my, perhaps our a press release or yeah. how the police department will hand, should put it in their hands and we should handle that. I, I would be uh, pleased, Council, to take that as uh, part of the uh, planning process to get uh, to, to, to make sure that um, we're accommodating this in a proper fashion. Thank you. Okay, we, and we need, need to make no comment either pro or no comment whatsoever. Okay. Thank you. Then, uh, what? Looking for a motion to adjourn? To meet now? It looks like 1:15 for motion to go into closed.